here in the beautiful mountains of Las Vegas for the Bronco Off Rodeo and a Gallup and Ford event for our customers and dear friends. This is the first big off-road event we're doing at Galpin in a long time. Off-roading and 4x4s and Broncos are really deep within the Galpin DNA. So to come back now after all these years, having a brand new Bronco and really getting back into that gear of taking our friends and our customers off-road again is... It's just a blast. We have 45 Broncos on the mountain. So myself, I'm gonna take one team, yeah. Bo's gonna take another team, and then Tim's gonna take the third team. This day on the mountain is all about finding out what these Broncos can do. These are amazing machines with insane features that'll take a bad day on the mountain and turn it into an unforgettable day on the mountain. This is a full day of off-roading. We have three different courses varying in difficulty. And it's really, one, to have a lot of fun, and two, to see what your Bronco can do. And that you're using, uh, actually, Ford's Broncos, so you don't have to worry about messing up your own, which is kind of nice. This is the biggest group they've ever had, so Galpin has taken over the entire mountain and having our own exclusive event. This is what it's about. For me, it's been a few years, so good to get some of the basics done and get out there on the course and uh, see what these things can do. Hopefully, it uh, won't do too much damage. They're starting off with kind of the basics, which is good. It's great to be with the Galpin community and our friends having some fun together. That's really what it's about. At the end of the day, Broncos, sure they can take you from A to B, but the fun is when you get out here and get it off the road. This already is, uh, it's a little gnarly. I started off-roading at a very young age. Uh, as soon as I got my driver's license, my first vehicle was a Land Cruiser. And gradually, I built up my experience level. So the team from the Bronco Off Rodeo is amazing at what they do. They are running the show, but we're here to make sure we uh, form a bond with our customers and let them know that we are here for them and we are the knowledgeable one when it comes in, uh, in regards to off-roading and that whole lifestyle of how to use your truck appropriately and what it's capable of. This looks pretty gnarly. Uh, we have a line of rocks next to an obstacle purposely there, so you have to go on the obstacle. You can't avoid it. If you line over, our, if you run over a little line of rocks, uh, you are more than likely going to bottom out on that section. It's one thing to see a part on the shelf. You see a coilover suspension, it looks great on the shelf, but how is it gonna perform in the real world? You're gonna see it here in front of you. So what we're doing here is demonstrate all the features that the Bronco has, the trail turn assist, the lockers, how much articulation the Bronco can obtain, what angles it can reach, as well as how the sway bar disconnects work in some of the models like the Badlands. One of the, my favorite features that they added to the new Broncos is the front and rear locking differentials. Having a front locking differential in addition to a rear locking differential is an immense amount of capability. When things get a little bit more off camber and you really, really start to feel the body shift and the weight shift left and right, having that front locking differential allows the vehicle to not only be pushing from the rear, but to have that traction in the front that's gonna pull you up the next obstacle. The great outdoors just feels spiritually beautiful. And to get out here with nature is uh, really something special. And uh, I don't take it for granted. And uh, what a beautiful sight it is. Doing events is really special because it really embraces the Galpin family. I've got my family up here, my son's here, my nephew, my brothers. So uh, we're gonna have some fun out here and, uh, and do a little family bonding. We made it to the top of the mountain. Absolutely beautiful ride, gorgeous views. Driving's the best part, so let's get back to it.